and wanted a shutdown. Leader McConnell, then Speaker Ryan, Speaker uh, Leader Pelosi then, and I agreed to keep the government funded. And yet here we are in the third week of the Trump shutdown. Why? It's only because of one person, and that is President Trump. Just about every expert you speak to says uh, that there's far more effective ways to deal with the border. Um, drones, helicopters, some kinds of fencing in some places, not a wall. Second, it's expensive. The president's asking for 5.7 billion, but that's just for a small piece of the wall. Estimates are it could go up to as much as 70 billion dollars, okay? And of course, that 70 billion is not being paid for by Mexico. I think most New Yorkers and most Americans agree with me. We want the symbol of America to stay as the Statue of Liberty, not a big concrete wall. In New York State, there are 51,676 federal employees at last count. 16,600 of them work in departments or agencies that are currently shut down. The bottom line is very simple. This is not the way to govern. To pound your fist on the table and cause damage to millions of people unless I get my way. It's not what the Constitution says. You know, elections have some consequences. The president couldn't pass his wall when the Republicans controlled the House and the Senate because they knew it was a bad idea. And now, he's creating a shutdown even though elections, in the election, he certainly was repudiated in the House and doesn't control it anymore. So we need to do, we need to get over this shutdown and saner heads must prevail. Please join me in thanking the Senator and good luck tonight.